want to put this uh, this picture up. This is and get the reaction from you guys that Democrats are seizing on this. Vice President Mike Pence tweeted out a photo uh, with the message. Appreciated joining the POTUS of the meeting with the Freedom Caucus again today. This is it. Passed the bill. Democratic Senator uh, Patty Murray, though, retweeted it and adding the message. A rare look inside the GOP's Women's Caucus, <laughs> yeah, Malika Henderson. But let's look at that picture again because there's not. Um, there's there are no women. Uh, and they're deciding all, on yeah. uh, women it, for pediatrics, all, maternity yeah, care, and uh, I also have uh, a friend who said who who texted me and said. Um, the only brown thing in that picture is a table. They're, yeah. they're, 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 they're yeah. diverse, yeah. diversity. And, and that is, yeah, I mean, that is, no, no, that's well, the health well, of the Ileana Ross Layton, Virginia Fox, Kathy McMorris Rogers, Mar they, Marsha Blackburn. They, they, they already know how to vote. Yeah. See, see, women are ahead of the folks who are in that picture. Go on. So. I mean, optically, uh, it's terrible, see. right? I mean, for a party that struggled uh, to, to, to get women in and to, to bring in uh, minorities. I mean, in this uh, sort of, I, I think, it really. Uh, is emblematic of the problem. The table and, and, was brown. Yeah, I mean, good, <laughs> congratulations <laughs> on, the, on the brown table. Yeah, thank you for uh, showing and, the and, you know, people have sort of been, I think one of the problems with President Trump's uh, administration generally is the lack of diversity. Yeah. In cabinet picks, it's one of the least diverse uh, cabinets when also, we've had. You, you see, you, you Vermin, see, you uh, see minorities Chow, who come to yeah. the White House for the most part. Right. There are some minorities who work in the White House, but you see minorities come to the White House, and it's often a photo op, and you yeah, see photo op. Hold on one second. Today. Hold on, will you let me get my point in? And you see the photo ops of the people who are sitting around him. Many times it's not diverse, but the times that it is diverse, um, it's a photo op. Yeah. And there's nothing actually happening. There's no uh, legislation that comes Elizabeth from it. Taylor it is sitting behind. the perception of something. Yeah, yeah, and this is, Mar Mary Elizabeth Taylor. She's which right is a perception, which is her, sort her of, I mean, is, which is she's the right behind Gordon, placement the, of one of the black staffers the, in the White House. I mean, Jack, that's what it really was. You can't look at that picture and say, That's a we have, and, and not though. agree, we have a long way to go. But, when all you have is all white guys like us, sitting around a table, and that's the inner sanctum where we're a big decision. It is the House Freedom but, Caucus, and I don't think there are any women caucus, and there are no but, black But yesterday he had a... We don't House. believe in freedom. He, he reached out to the <laughs> Congressional not. Black Caucus, who has not one single vote there, probably won't be many votes throughout the... The question is the, how many the, women are in the picture. That's what we were talking about. Yeah, and zero. Uh, yeah, because there are but no women. Twenty-five in the people. Caucus, are there? There are no. Are there any women? I, I actually, I don't know yeah. who's in the freedom. And, and they're, they're they're discussing Kathy now to scrap essential yeah. health benefits, which include maternity care and pediatrics. Yeah. and it's all men. Virginia in that Fox is chair of the the Health and Education Committee, or the Education Committee, and uh, very uh, actually the first woman of any party from North Carolina, where you went to school. I did. To, to, to be to hold a gavel. Yeah. Think about that. In See, the I House of Representatives, the first, first of, woman from North a Carolina. A lot of times it's like window dressing. A gavel. It's like, it's I, think, I think the reason people. we're pointing this out is because the, the Freedom Caucus is that's the group that held this bill up. Yeah. They didn't want these essential services in the bill, and that's who's deciding. I know. Yeah. And, and, and I am not defending this by any stretch of the imagination because clearly there is an issue here. But but as Jack does say, right? As the former congressman does say. Those are members who represent a certain constituency. Now, if you look at the Democratic Party, they, uh, you know, their base is made up of, of African Americans and, and what have you. But I will say this is a greater problem on Capitol Hill, and perhaps you gentlemen can agree or disagree with me on this, in both parties, quite frankly, where there is not enough diversity amongst staff members uh, uh, up on Capitol Hill in either party. Now, you can cherry pick and say, well, so-and-so here and so-and-so there. Yeah. But overall, across the board, that has always been You here. know more about it than I do, and I think you're probably right. We can always do better.